morning and welcome to Education 2.0. Could you kindly introduce yourself and tell us what you do? Thanks, Lee. It's great. I'm very, very glad to be here. Um, Dallas Dance. I am the uh, president and CEO of the D Dance Group. Uh, we are a leadership and strategy based consultant practice based in Richmond, Virginia, uh, who works with schools and districts across the country and across the world to improve educational outcomes for all kids. I'm also the founder of the Principals Club which is a K-12 tech app based on oh. leadership coaching uh, for school principals. So it's exciting to be here. Wonderful. Thank you. And how do you feel about winning this award? Could you let us know about the factors that led you to win this award? So, I mean, there's so many educators across the country who are doing some amazing work. And so for me to be winning this, it's extremely humbling. Um, mm -hmm. I, I dedicate it to really the thousands of students and families and educators I've had an opportunity to work with. But what it says is that our work continues. Um, Post-COVID, there's a lot of work that we have to do, and leadership is extremely critical. So the opportunity to be recognized by Education 2.0 here in Las Vegas, I'm pretty excited by it. Great. And we are honored to have you here. What do you think about Education 2.0? How has your experience been on Education 2.0 so far? I've enjoyed Education 2.0, and I think primarily it's because of the networking. Um, over the last two years, obviously, we have not had this. And so there are many people who are there glad to be back in front of each other, meeting new people. And I think what people are recognizing is that the stakes in education have just been raised for all of us. Absolutely. And so Education 2.0 has given us an opportunity to bring topics together on what we can do post-COVID. Uh, but at the end of the day, how do we bring others together to make sure that we all are on the same page what we need to do? And where there are differences of opinion, hey, let's talk about it. But at the end of the day, we know that education is how we're all going to make our country in our world a better place. It's been wonderful how you've navigated during the pandemic and, and post-COVID. It so. has been, um, but you know, I'm on the sort of business side of it, and my heart goes out to our healthcare professionals mm -hmm. and really our, our educators, who they've had to really be in the classroom living it on the ground. And we work with roughly about a thousand um, schools and or districts, so it's a combination of both, um, or nonprofit organizations who support educators, educators, and they're the ones every day who are going in and, and dealing with it and seeing it on the ground. Um, so as they navigate it, we recognize that leadership is extremely critical. Mm -hmm. And that's our lane that we like to work with our, our principals and our district level leaders and administrators to recognize the policies, practices, and behaviors that need to change for all kids to be successful. Yes, thank you for supporting. And where can we find your company's business uh, information details? Absolutely. So the D Dance Group can be found at www.thedancegroup. So make sure you have two D's. Uh, but you also can reach us at uh, www.drdallasdance.com, which is me, and I can direct a lot of people to whatever company uh, they need to have. So people always like to remember Dallas Dance, so if you just put the doctor in front of it, DR, um, we can absolutely get you to the, country, the company you need to be with. Wonderful. Thank you so much for being here. Thank you, Lee, for It's an honor to have you. It. Enjoy the